I am ready to do step four in my journaling by fives with a buddy. This is the last step that I will do in Kate's journal. I will do step five in my journal when I get it back. So, uh, oh, it's kind of bittersweet. It's coming to an end. <laughs> but before I get started on this, I'm going to show you what Kate sent. She sent this envelope. She sent a, a very, very sweet note. And this little ATC. Beautiful kind of mixed media ATC that she had made. I love that and these fabulous vintage uh, photographs. Look at that. Those are awesome. Very cool. Thank you, Kate. And she also sent, okay, this graph paper. You know what? I have a couple of sheets similar to this, and I kind of hoard it because I don't have very many, but I love this. It has little tea tiny boxes. And I love, you know, lined paper for journals because I like to write on lines. So that's what I prefer. So this is great. And some fantastic book pages, maybe Japanese. I'm not sure. My daughter will know. And put that down. <laughs> Those are great. And some really cool sheet music. Oh, look, pre-punched pre-punched for your convenience. Look at that. That is great. And this, oh this, this was very exciting to me. This is a, a graph paper, but it's on manila paper. Look at that. I've never seen this before. Graphed manila paper. That's way cool. I really like that. That was exciting. And I'm so glad she sent more of these bingo papers. <laughs> these are so fun. Look, here's some blue ones. But she said she had quite a few of these. These, I've been having fun with the ones that she sent last time. Oh, that's, see, that's different. Cool. Um, these are just really great for collage bits and stuff. And the paper's thin. So, yeah, they're all kinds of fun. Very cool. Thank you so much, Kate. I appreciate that very, very much. Okay, now on to the good part, the fun. Okay, journal ready. Oh, um, this is step four, the um, focal images or words and phrases, things like that. So, I have just a few words and phrases to use. I'm going to kind of spread stuff out so I can see it because, you know, it's all stacked on each other. I can't find it. I know it's there. Okay. I'll need this. I want to make sure I'm in frame here. I'm in frame? Yeah, I'm in frame. Okay. So, I'll put that there. These are images from magazines and catalogs and that was one of my flowers I made. Scrapbook paper, um, you know, various and sundry places like that. Some of them have a temporary adhesive on the back because that's how I store them in my binder two glue sticks this time, so I don't run out. Okay. I can see them. And I've got some of my um, Yes Paste decals out here. Y'all, I have found, um, you know, I was really concerned about using these in here because of the potential disaster if later on Kate decides to use Mod Podge or a wet adhesive which reacts very badly with the Yes Paste. I took them outside and sprayed them with a clear sealer, you know, like a Krylon. Mine wasn't Krylon, it was some craft brand. But it was just a clear spray sealer, sprayed both sides, let them dry good. Perfect. I, I used my little junk book where I test stuff and, you know, slapped Mod Podge on them and, and did the decoupage technique to glue them down. 
no problems at all. So FYI, good solution if you are um, worried about your yes paste decals coming in contact with a water-based um, product later on. Just seal them, spray sealer. So I've got several, mostly flowers, and I know, you know, because I've, I've already worked in her journal before, so I kind of know what colors are going on in there. So I just picked kind of bright colors or see the black for contrast. So maybe these will work, I hope. These were some that I had, uh, before I figured out the uh, decal process, I just attached them to some deli wrap. So I'll set these over here. I might use those. All right, see so now I've got everything spread out so I can see. And I can't open the book. Okay, good, good. Oh, I haven't done a JB5 session in a while. <laughs> I'm a little nervous. <laughs> All right. Oh, I, can, I can open to page one. And I'm going to get a timer set. 15 minutes on the clock. Ready, set. And, oh, I am going to um, just use a glue stick to kind of place them, you know, tack them down because um, this is not a contest to see how fast you can glue stuff down. That doesn't do anybody any good. The, the timer in this step, the purpose of it is to see how fast you can decide which images to use and then decide where to place them. And then once you place them, they're down. They can't move. You can go back after the timer goes off and secure them down really good with more glue or Mod Podge or whatever, but don't move them. So that's what I'm going to do is just kind of tack them down with some glue stick and then after the timer I'll go in and secure them good. Okay, now see that way I get my full 15 minutes to make my decision about which image to use and where to place it. That's the purpose. Okay, I'm nervous and I'm stalling. <laughs> How funny. <laughs> okay. Uh, check in this here. Are we in frame? We're in frame. Okay, here we go. Ready, set, go. All right. Uh, oh, now that it's go time, I'm freaking out. Uh, yes. Now, see, you're going to have to stay put. putting glue stick on the back of the image and on your um, paper helps. I don't know. Something's not right about that. Something's not right about that either. Oh dear. I'm having a moment of indecision. There. I don't even know if that's right or wrong, but I'm not going to take the time to study it because apparently I'm having issues. This one needs, what does it need? I feel like I just don't have any images to choose from. I thought I had so many. There. Felt like I had way too many, and now I'm feeling like I don't have enough. What's up with that? Okay, that's a weird little, there we go. Now, this one. Uh -uh. Oh, I don't like any of my images. Crap. This always happens. Oh, there. That works in here. Okay. That needs. Walt. That. No. No. Yes. Oh. <laughs> I'll later in the glue. 
you know, y'all could pr politely pretend not to notice that I did that. <laughs> Whoopsie! <laughs> uh, okay. That one, yeah. This is much easier now that I've quit thinking about it. <laughs> Can you tell? Yeah, just grab one. I forgot to turn my brain off before I got started a minute ago. Um, okay. I'm doing it again. Well, I chose that one to begin with. Let's just go with it. Too tall. I'll end up cutting her feet off and she'll look funny. Okay. I reject you. Rejection. Okay. You, by gosh, are going to get used because I've been holding on to this one for a long time. And I pulled him out of my stash, determined to give him purpose in life. What's our time look like? Uh, 8.54 left. Okay, we're in good shape. This is such a weird little thing. This is right side up like this. Which is odd because, you know, naturally you just want to do that. But it's one of those that hangs down. Yeah, okay. glued something to my finger. It's bothering me. Uh-uh. Yeah. She came off of a uh, container store sale catalog. <laughs> That's what she was. Okay, I'll stick you there. Now, this one has got a lot going on, so maybe I just need some black and white. I don't like it. It's not working. Okay. Oh, well, yeah. Actually, yeah. Okay. Well, that just covers the whole page. That was a bad idea. This one. Mm, yes. You go there? You go there. Gonna kind of sink into the background, but it's okay because I like it there. Oh, okay, we're done. What's that? 556. All right, let's see what we can do with maybe some of these phrases. And I have a few extra images left over. 
Okay. Um, I kind of like. Don't sweat it. Okay, she came off of a scrapbook page, and this is the phrase that went with her. So I'm going to use that with her. She seeks out what she wants out of life. happy. That's what I'm talking about. That absolutely makes me happy. Well, visions, of course. a rooster. Wake up! Oh, here. I keep wanting to put this somewhere. I'm going to. Just give it a little, little something extra. Okay. Uh, to a happy life. So, you know, I'm just messing. That could really use some color, huh? Why not? And I've just totally kind of confused the whole, you know, focal point concept. Oh, that's okay. Kate can fix that in free play. <laughs> Alright, it's all good. Through it one more time. How much time do we have? Two minutes. Man, where's all this time coming from? Did I forget something? Have I got pages stuck together? No, I guess, that's, I guess we're good. All right. Well, let me see. Uh, I've got some more of these laying here. Maybe I'll see if they jump out and want to be put down somewhere. No, they're all, they're looking pretty good to me. Really. No. You know what? I'm going to call it done. Okay, I'm going to stop the clock with, oh, a big uh, 23 seconds left to go. And I'll do a slower flip through so you can see what we've got. And y'all, when your glue stick runs out like this, I hope you know to um, get you a like a toothpick or a pokey tool or something. What do I have? Pointy. I need a pointy something. I have nothing pointy. I have a needle. This will work. There is tons of glue still down there in the bottom. I mean, see, it goes all the way down. So when your glue stick runs out and gets flat, oh, don't throw it away. 
dig around because there is a whole bunch of glue still in it. <laughs> FYI. From, you know, she who is super cheap and squeezes every last drop out of everything. Alright, I promised to flip through, didn't I? Is that what I said? Let's do that. Now, here we go. I skipped a page. We have the magazine doggy saying, don't sweat it. Love that page. And some flowers there. That was from a napkin. And scrapbook page girl. Another napkin. Napkin. A magazine uh, page. She was an advertisement for something that I can't remember. And a napkin. Magazine. Napkin. Uh, book page that I uh, cut out and doodled on. That was actually a sample of some uh, stock. You know, they have these samples of different papers and card stocks, like in design magazines. That's where I got that. And that was magazines. And a napkin. And that was an ad in a magazine, I think. And another magazine. And the um, container store sale catalog. <laughs> magazine. Napkin. Napkins. And napkin. So there we have it. I'm going to get my Mod Podge out and uh, glue those down really good and then send this little guy back to Kate so she can do step five. And I had fun. That was a lot of fun. Okay, so that's all I have. The end.